what's cracking guys i'm brandon this is da vinci's alchemist or if you are watching this on instagram right now this is alchemisted uh so i'm posting this video on both instagram and my youtube channel um if you are watching this on instagram and you haven't been to my youtube channel uh pop into my bio and go check out my youtube channel and vice versa if you're watching this on youtube and you haven't been to my instagram link down below and you will have my uh, instagram address so recently I purchased the new offering from Zoologist, which is Snowy Owl. Really love that. I'll have a video coming up for that here pretty soon. I just still haven't edited it. Um, but I wanted to get my first impressions out to you guys on two that I received as gifts, uh, two samples that I received as gifts with that purchase. Uh, one of them is the new uh, version of Macaque, which is uh, Yuzu edition which if I'm not mistaken, now this is pretty much just me repeating what I've heard. I haven't fact checked this, so you know, if I'm wrong, I'm sorry. Uh, but I do believe that uh, perfumer Mackenzie Riley it did the new version of Macaque. Uh, and then on top of that, there is another one that I had no idea about, and that is Chipmunk. So I am going to be slapping these on. I got two free hands right now. I'm gonna put, uh, Macaque on this hand, I'm gonna put chipmunk on this hand. I'm gonna go do some laundry, do some chores, stuff like that. After I give you my like first impression, first impression, and then we'll check out the dry down a little bit and we'll let you guys know what I think about that. So hopefully you're into it. Uh, let's just head on to it without further ado. So I will start off with the Macaque Yuzu edition. I am gonna put a little bit on the spray strip just for future reference for tomorrow. Uh, here we go on the skin. Give it a couple, like three or four. All right, here we go. Ooh. So now I have the original macaque. I have a full bottle of that and I love it to death. This is, I'm gonna have to test the two of them against each other, but I can definitely tell a difference. There is some much woodier elements in this. Definitely get a much stronger citrus presence in this. Uh, I don't really get any of that same green tea effect as in the original. Ooh. But I like it. Digging that. So right out of the gate, like I said, citruses, some woods. There's some florals involved. There's something in there that I'm having a hard time pointing out, but I'm into it. I'm really into it. I'm going to interested to see how where this goes so let's roll right over into the one i'm super excited about which is chipmunk because i mean who knows what this could be like right i'm super interested to see the interpretation so oh uh three four sprays on the hand all right i'm getting spiciness out of that straight out of the gate oh that's cool okay so that's kind of sweet there's a little bit of a nutty vibe which i think is pretty apropos that's not, that's not really what I was expecting. This is kind of a kind of a spicy aspect. I almost figured it might be more green, but I'm not getting a lot of green out of the gate. It's almost kind of uh, yeah. There's a little bit of sweetness. Uh, I don't want to say it's vanillic, but okay. There's a little bit of green now. Okay, so like I was saying, uh, I'm gonna go do some chores, let these dry down a little bit, and then I'll be right back at you with the follow up to see where I'm at, what I think. All right, I'm back. This is my final thoughts. Again, as a reminder, this is so totally first impressions. I've got a lot of, um, got a lot of diving deep into these to get really figured them out. Uh, but I will say this about both of them. I find them both super pleasant, super easy to wear. These are going to be some of the easier, um, less challenging fragrances coming out of zoologist in my opinion. Um, both really, really awesome. Both very different timestamps, uh, you know, seasonally that I feel like these would be appropriate for. With Macaque, the the kind of like intermediate dry down on it, the the middle area. Uh, I'm getting. I could be totally wrong, way off base, but I'm getting this sense of sandalwood going on with it. I wouldn't be surprised if it was in there. It has something poppy in it, something effervescent, effervescent, a little bubbly. But uh, it's it's definitely interesting. I definitely want to spend some more time with it. So definitely not um, 
putting that to the wayside is one that I wouldn't be interested in. So I'll be checking this one out further on in the future. And Chipmunk, man, I'm telling you, I'm starting to get what I think might be a little bit of a green aspect. There's, I'm trying to figure it out, but I love the spice. I love it. It kind of reminds me of nutmeg. Um, there's almost something lactonic, like a, like a slight milky vibe. It's not super creamy or anything like that. It's not, uh, it's not like, you know, like a glass of milk, but there is a lactonic effect that I'm getting. The woodiness in it is super smooth. It's almost kind of dry. It's like a, yeah, definitely like a dry wood. I'm interested to spend some more time with that one, especially. I think out of the two, I'm going to say Chipmunk for me is uh, the one that I'm most interested in. It's the one that seems to be doing uh, the most changing from the first spray to the dry down, just, you know, to my nose. Obviously, uh, individual results may vary. Check it out for yourself. So again, that's pretty much it. Uh, I think these are going to be some pretty interesting new releases from Zoologist. Um, if you guys have not heard of Zoologist, I highly suggest that for some reason, uh, I highly suggest that you check them out. Really great house. And I hope that you liked hearing about these too. Again, uh, if you are watching this on Instagram, hop over to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you're watching this on YouTube, pop on over to my Instagram channel. Tell me what you think. Check out my pictures, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, that's it for me. I was trying to make this as quick as possible and also as informative as I could. A little middle ground, you know what I'm saying? So hope you guys are having a great night, great weekend, great evening. Please take care of yourselves and each other, no matter what you're doing, no matter where you're going, no matter what animal you're hanging out with. That was my dog. Uh, keep calm. Stink pretty. I'll see you on the next one.